Hello, welcome again to Boron Basics. I'm Matt Blast, and this week we're going to talk about polkas. And when we talk about polkas, we're also going to talk about songs. A lot of uh, popular Irish songs use a polka rhythm. So as you learn to accompany polkas, you'll learn a lot about accompanying songs as well. What is a polka? Well, it's a, it's a rhythm in two, where the reel was in four, and the accent was kind of on the, the initial beat. Da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da. And a two and a three and a four and a. A polka is in two, so it's still evenly divisible by two, but it really has um, a one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two type of feel to it. Um, and when you think about polkas, you think about Polish or German kind of umpa band, the umpa, 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 umpa type of sound. Uh, an Irish polka, same idea, basically, a one, two, one, two kind of two step feeling to it. Um, and the accents on those are going to be one, two, one, two, really on the downstrokes. I'll give you a couple examples of what a polka might sound like. Melody-wise, grab the mandolin, um, like a popular one, Bridges Full of Stitches. Getting that umpa in there, so the the melody doesn't necessarily do 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 do, but the the rhythm pattern to it do it does. Uh, and by the same token, you know, popular songs like "I'll Tell My Ma" have that same polka rhythm. You get the idea. How do we make that work on the boron? Well, instead of just that, we're still using our backhand and our accents to change our tone. And the really basic one is your open closed again. The, if you're in a polka band, you might have a drum kit where you have that bass snare, the boom pop, boom pop, bass snare, bass snare. On the boron, you have open closed and again you think with the heart of the rhythm is in those down strokes it's a little bit dull when you just do it that way but you can jazz it up a little bit by with just one extra stroke so if you do boom bop, you've got your boom bop one two one two, but if you make it one two and one two, one two and one, one two and one two and one two and one two, and one, two and. so that's one two. So just that and the uh, the eighth note, remember counting like a drummer, on the second beat. Tell my mama when I go home, the boys won't leave the girls alone. Pull my hair and I'll stole my comb, that's all right till I go home. Much more interesting, right? Same with the... So polka 
add more ornamentation, more variety than that. You can do straight up. But the basic rhythm is still that boom. And there you have it, your basic polka. Now, because they tend to be fairly simple and fairly peppy two-step, they tend to be played really fast, uh, both in sessions and in songs as well. So you really, you know, getting that down is good, but you should be able to play it But that's your practice. Practice slow again, starting through metronome at maybe 90 BPM and keep bumping it up until it becomes second nature. And you'll have this in no time. I'll give you some play along tracks, including uh, the song I uh, mentioned and maybe a tune as well. All right.